Hello Raiders, my name is Mr. Mosley, and I am one of your administrators for the Early College High School. I'm Mrs. Wynn, and I'm your counselor and a second administrator for the Early College High School. We'd like, like to, to welcome, welcome you to, to the 2021-2022 school year. There are a few items that we would like to go over so that you can have a great start to the school year. First, let's discuss some procedures. Because you are a dual credit student, you are expected to navigate both Fort Worth ISD's platforms and TCC's platforms. We know that many students have had trouble logging into their TCC Canvas and TCC email. Here's a quick tip. Most student emails and usernames are their first name dot last name at my.tccd.edu. If it is your first time logging into the TCC interface, there's a generic password. There are instructions on the TCC login screen for how to use the password, but I will let you know that it is a capital T, lowercase cc, your seven digit TCC ID number, and then your six digit birth date. For example, if you were born on January 1st of 2006, your six digit birth date is 010106. TCC professors will communicate with you through Canvas and email. It's important that you check your email, TCC email, and Fort Worth ISD email every day. In, in addition, you should check your email multiple times a day. Student and students, college students and college teachers utilize email as a primary way to communicate. To stay in touch with updates from the ECHS office, please sign up for our Remind. Freshmen should join by texting at SHS ECHS 25 to the number 81010. And sophomores should join by texting at SHS ECHS 24 to the number 81010. This is one of the ways that we can remind you of due dates and important tasks, such as completing TCC paperwork. All right, there are some of you that did not qualify for dual credit this semester because of residency issues and because of the pass packet. Please remember to get these done as soon as possible and email them to both Mr. Mosley and me. In addition, please stay on top of your grades so that you're not in, a situ in the same situation next semester where you have to fill out extra paperwork for TCC. Let's take a moment to talk about the culture of our program. For all who are new to the ECHS, we have six core values and one statement that sums them all up. Here they are. We are the ECHS Raiders. We are responsible, aspiring, intelligent, determined, eager, and respectful. We are striving to be the best. Most students are displaying these characteristics and they're doing it well. And we want to give you a shout out in just a minute. However, there are some students who are having a harder time demonstrating these attributes and the conduct does not uphold our core values. Um, some of this conduct includes skipping class, walking the hallways, showing up tardy to class, using disrespectful, inappropriate, and vulgar language. Should Mrs. Wynn or I notice these behaviors or should your teachers report them to us, here are possible consequences. Number one, a phone call and a home warning. Um, number two, you could be placed on a contract. And number three, if, there are another, if there's another incident while you are on contract, you could be expelled from the program. We want to make sure that everyone has the best experience possible at our school and upholding the core values is one way that we can ensure a healthy and productive learning environment. This brings us to our last item, which is students who are already demonstrating the core values well. We would like to recognize the following people for their efforts towards success and their dedication to the early college high school. Our first student was nominated by Ms. Strahan. Ahmed Alaboudi is doing amazing. He participates readily in class and contributes in a positive way to deepen discussions. His enthusiasm is definitely contagious. Ms. Bond told us that Tehran Francis, also known as TJ, is amazing and he's really thoughtful um, of his classmates, super smart, and he's passing it on. Ms. Hendrick Seligman said, Sam, Samantha, Pettis, works hard and communicates with me when she has a question. 
She helps her classmates and participates in our collaborative activities with enthusiasm. Ms. Barks told us that Halla Jefferson is hardworking, she does all of her work, and she doesn't mind helping her classmates when they need it. Ms. Arnold, Ms. Peekaboo Taylor, enthusiastic, demonstrates responsibility, respects peers, has a positive attitude. I love her. All right, ECHS Raiders, we look forward to seeing you in the hallways and in class. Uh, we appreciate y'all. Keep up the hard work. Uh, y'all make Southwest and the early college the place to be. Thanks, and we'll see you soon.